It's quiet right now, but the Hampton Roads Convention Center could soon see waves of people coming in. On Wednesday, we discussed several preliminary site options. The Corps has continued its evaluation since then, and I have approved their final recommendations. Governor Ralph Northam chose the convention center to be an alternative care center with the help of local hospitals, the Army Corps of Engineers, FEMA, and the National Guard. Its goal is to free up hospital beds as the state battles the coronavirus. And there's still more to be done. The next steps are to complete contracts, move into design, and then to construction. Teams are moving fast and we expect these alternative care sites to be ready in about six weeks. So just how many beds could the Hampton Roads Convention Center hold? Well, Governor Northam says 360 acute beds for the more severe cases or 580 beds for the rather less intense and less severe cases. For some, like Red Jones, it's great to just do a couple of laps. You know, I normally walk around here. The convention center is a landmark to walk by on one of his occasional strolls. I'm thankful that the governor is uh, on it, you know, jumping, jumping the gun before the cases get too high. At the same time, once the patients fill in, he says he'll find another route to walk. At the same time, he's feel a little bit uneasy because, you know, it's getting really serious. We have to have a makeshift hospital made in Virginia right here where we're all sitting here right next to the businesses on Mercury. And it's in May that Northam says, We'll see a surge in the number of cases. In Hampton, Julio Avila, News 3.